I'm Sarah Schroth, the director of the National Museum of Art at Duke University. The painting behind me, the mural behind me, we commissioned from Odili Odita, an artist we love, and when he came to Duke and did his research, that's what he focused on, was the Julian Abel story. And so it means a great deal in honor of our 10th anniversary that an artist would choose this as a, as a subject, as, a, as an homage to that, to that architect. Julian Abel is the designer of this campus. All these buildings are his. He drew them in, in, in uh, 1928, 9, and he is the architect of Duke. The mission of the Julian Abel Committee was to uh, get together, faculty, staff, and the idea was to get together and talk about um, how we could best commemorate Julian Abel, because for many, many years it was not known that he was Duke's architect. If you don't buy the mural, then the artist contract says that it has to be painted over in three years. So I mentioned to the committee that this was, of course, uh, in honor of Abel, and wouldn't it be nice if we could buy this? Duke University Office of the President stepped in and bought the mural. So now we have it forever. African American artists in America have not been on the uh, radar of the great museums, the Met and the MoMA, etc. They've been ignored. And so there's a parallel between, um, between Julian Abel being ignored for so many years because he was African American and these artists like Odili. Um, who were also ignored. It was just amazing to learn this and to see that this is information that was kept in the dark uh, because of the design of, the, of, of those times. And, um, you know, to bring them back to light, I think, is really important. And I, and I love the way that it connects to, you know, this shadow and light play I have in that painting and the idea of bringing Julian Abel's history out of the shadows and into the light of day. I think that there is one color that is different than all the other colors, and that's this section. And this section, if you look at it, looks a lot like a steeple. And so for me, I think that's the reference, the specific reference to Julian Abel as the architect of Duke Chapel. Not that we have a steeple at Duke Chapel, but that steeples usually sort of equal church. I'd want the average visitor to meditate on this work. There are amazing color juxtapositions, amazing shapes and lines. The amount of care that he put in, the artist himself, um, Odita, put into the design is is, is the same care that Julian Abel put into his design. I mean, there's a connection there. 